For the best in eyewear, call Dr. Leak's Optometry. Kevin O'Neill and Eric Porninga are still adjusting to their new life after becoming parents to not one, not two, but three identical baby girls. Starting with the oldest, Parker, she's always just been sort of the leader of the the, the pack in, in the sense that she was the first one born. Robin is the fiery one. She's either calm or she's screaming. And then Sylvie is the smallest and she, we always call her, like she makes the cutest noises, she squeaks. Kevin and Eric have always wanted a family and spent a long time researching their options before deciding on surrogacy. One of our really good friends here um, knew Maureen, who are our surrogate, um, and she connected us. They agreed it would be best to use an egg donor, meaning Maureen would not be the biological mother. However, none of them could have predicted that the embryo used would eventually split into three. Identical triplets, just completely rare, just so unexpected. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I remember just feeling really up for the adventure. It was like, well, we're here, we're doing this. Maureen was closely monitored throughout the pregnancy since she was considered high risk. Fortunately, there were no major complications <laughs> and her delivery at Cleveland Clinic went well. The little girls uh, did did well. They were managed again by our NICU team. All of them were born in the four to five pounds uh, weight range. Um, and I think that they stayed within the NICU um, about two to three weeks. <laughs> Kevin and Eric are now getting ready to celebrate their first Father's Day, and they couldn't be more grateful. I just can't imagine. Because <laughs> that's just a fantasy at this point. For Cleveland Clinic, I'm Brittany Harris.